All right, moving on here, Minnesota and Wisconsin, they will play uh, Thursday. This is going to be at 4.30 Eastern tip time. Uh, it is first-team All-American uh, favorite Marcus Carr versus the Wisconsin Badgers. Uh, Marcus Carr also has Booth Gotch on his team. Uh, so first-team All-American, uh, first-team All-Name player against the Wisconsin Badgers. Who do you like in this one? I think this, you know, I'm big on Minnesota. I'm big on Wisconsin. It's a tough game for me just because they're two teams that play just contrasting styles. You have the fast pace of Minnesota compared to the slow, really slow pace of Wisconsin. I think that the big play of Wisconsin will be able to hurt Minnesota enough to where Wisconsin can be able to win. But the Ken Palm projected favorite Wisconsin by nine, I think it's going to be about a four point victory for Wisconsin. So I don't think Wisconsin will be able to cover those nine points there. But I think that Minnesota will be able to play well enough. Marcus Carr is obviously tremendous, but I don't think Minnesota has enough players to stop Micah Potter and Nate Reavers in this game. And I think Minnesota will be able to dictate, or I think Wisconsin will be able to dictate the pace on their home floor. Yeah, I I think Wisconsin's the smart pick. I will take Wisconsin. I, I think, like, you look at the Wisconsin team, they're, their experience, they know how to play fast teams. They know how to play slow teams. Like they've been every, any type of style that they'll face, they've played that type of style before. And I think Wisconsin's players are overall just a little bit more well-rounded. I I think Marcus Card, best player in this game, he's going to be great. Uh, but like Lean Robbins. I think he's solid inside. You don't necessarily know what you're going to get out of him. Booth Gotches and Gabe Kalsher. Maybe Brandon Johnson has a big game like he had against Iowa uh, last week. We we don't really... I think with the core of Minnesota, we can't really trust it. Uh, I trust Marcus Carr more than I trust any of the Wisconsin Badgers players. But overall, the core of Minnesota is not... Like, I think... The second best player for Wisconsin is like, I think Trice is probably, would you say, the best player for Wisconsin? No, I would say Micah Potter probably from top to bottom is Wisconsin's best player just because he doesn't shoot the ball a ton, but when he does, he makes most of them. But right, Trice so, is second in my opinion. Yeah, so like you have Micah Potter, you could say Trice, like whoever it is, they're be- they're better than Booth Gotch. Uh, Brad Davidson and Nate Reavers are better than uh, Robbins and Kalsher. I think those are statements I'm comfortable with. Uh, I've liked what I've seen out of Johnny Davis. He's kind of a change of pace guard. Uh, Going to be, I think, a real good player in the future. But overall, I just think this Wisconsin team knows what they're doing. I think they win this game uh, probably by about seven or eight points. I don't think they'll get quite to that nine number that Kim Palm is projecting, but I think they'll win the game. Uh, Give me 74 to 67. I think Wisconsin wins. uh, Score is tough. I'll say, I think Wisconsin could score a lot in this game. I'll say 80 to 76, Wisconsin. All right. You've you've got a much more entertaining game than I do. Yeah. it, it certainly should be fun to watch. I, I'll be interested to see how they kind of guard uh, Micah Potter. Does Brad Davidson decide to try to punch him in the nuts? I don't know. He's done it to other players in the past. Uh, he's not full Grayson Allen, but definitely uh, so, someone that people aren't big fan of. Maybe they get Brad Davidson to foul out Marcus Carr by taking five charges. We don't know how they'll defend him, but... It's certainly going to be fun to watch. Yeah, definitely. It's a game to tune into. I could see Minnesota winning, but I think they, at the very least, don't lose by nine. That will wrap it up for Making the Madness. Make sure to subscribe to uh, us on uh, Apple Podcasts, Spotify, however you listen to the podcast, and to the YouTube channel. Uh, Make sure to subscribe to that. We'll be back next time.